Hello everyone and welcome back to the Sync's YouTube channel. Today I'll be doing a first look session review on the new game Far Cry 4 that just came out today. Experience the most expansive and immersed Far Cry to the date with Far Cry 4 on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360. Now some information on the game. Ubisoft's spectacular next gen debut on Far Cry series sees players exploring the remote region of Kyra. This beautiful area hidden in the Himalayas sees dangers at every turn. You take control of AJ Gale, travelling to Kairat at the behest of his dying mother, and become embroiled in a civil war to cast down the oppressive deposit Pagan Min. Explore an incredible diverse environment in Far Cry 4 from lush jungles to the snow caped hills of the Himalayas. Take advantage of the wide array of weapons, vehicles, and animals, whether you harness the power of a six ton elephant or scout enemy territory from above in a gyrocopter. You'll be prepared for anything. As always, it's got 1,000 games score and will most likely have a similar pattern as Far Cry 3, but might change some of them. As always, they have a psychotic leader or boss, whatever people call him. Everyone is different, and one thing about Far Cry is the leaders are amazing. I like how they have been designed, I like how they've got the voices that suit them. Everything is perfect. Same as before, Far Cry is a massive open world map with many things to do such like outposts and strongholds to take over, killing wildlife, to get the skin and meat and finding all the collectibles and chests for money to buy better guns, better weapons, everything like that, and all the hidden places to find. Because it is Far Cry, they have a wide range of transport to get around the map. Two things I cannot wait for is the riding elephant and skydive of the Himalayas. As you can see at the moment, the introduction is very weird, wild. As you would say, going back to Kyra on a bus, then you see two people bail out the back of the bus, then die, then your bus just gets the shot out. Shot out. It's really weird, but I guess that's how Far Cry works. On Far Cry 3, many people did not like multiplayer. I couldn't see how good it was, or bad it was, as people say, as, a, as you needed a code to play. But the co-op campaign was really good, I love that. Even though it was eight missions, it saw like that, some like that I think, yeah, some like that. It was really good. As I was loading up, I think you can play all of the Far Cry 4 normal campaign online. So I think you can have up to four of your friends playing. Obviously, as you can see at the moment, that's the main character, like boss, leader part. Stop. Is a bit, is a bit psychotic, I'd say, a bit, a bit uh, dodgy. Bus. as you will see in a second but there is many things you can do in Far Cry obviously you can go in sneakily Stop. use tiger's meat or you can shoot. scout out the area from above Stop. in the gyrocopter and then probably shoot, shoot a grenade launcher out of them and kill all the people or you can just go straight in on an elephant and then kill everyone so it's pretty pretty brutal what you can do as you can see now. Yeah. Damn. Obviously, there was one person next to you when you got off. I don't know who he is a minute, because obviously it's only five minutes in, but I guess he's going to play a part in the game somehow. We'll have to wait and find out. Obviously, it's in a civil war, so there's going to be obviously two factions fighting, I've got a feeling. Something like that. I don't know who the leader of the other faction is, obviously he does like lead one of the factions I could probably. I'm so sorry well, about this. This was supposed to be Before I go, maybe I'll see you on the ground of Kairat riding an elephant or flying through the air in the wingsuit. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe for more news on Far Cry 4. Goodbye.